It's the holiday shopping season, and that means it's also the holiday shoplifting season. Worldwide last year, shoplifters stole more than $1.8 billion in merchandise during the month before Christmas. With in-store security cameras and increased numbers of undercover guards, many retail thieves are getting caught and facing a criminal justice system that has its own secret compartments. If a person is arrested for shoplifting, they should definitely call a lawyer as soon as possible because that lawyer can help them start to do things that will help them even before they go to court. Los Angeles criminal defense attorney Steve Sitkoff has defended over 500 shoplifters. He says the plea bargaining that usually determines the fate of a shoplifter can be affected by rules that don't come from law books. Different courthouses have different cultures. Different prosecutor's offices have different ways of doing things. And to represent your client in the most effective way, you need to know what each courthouse and what each prosecutor does because they're all different. When a suspected shoplifter first gets caught, there's usually no lawyer around. But Sitkoff says there are things a person can do then that can make the lawyer's defense job much easier. Don't resist. If the suspected shoplifter uses physical force to get away, a petty theft misdemeanor can become felony robbery. While detained, make no statements to security officers. Anything a detainee says can be used against her. If security asks to search a detainee's bag or pockets, Sikoff advises that he or she cooperate. Store security then will typically contact the local police to make an arrest. A person who's arrested for shoplifting, one of a couple of things will happen. They'll either be cited at the scene and released and given a future court date, or they'll actually be taken down to a police station and, and booked and then released. Either way, they should contact an attorney as soon as possible, within a day or so. If a shoplifting arrest ends in conviction, it typically doesn't include jail time. Most people who are arrested for shoplifting are experiencing stresses and pressures in their lives that have caused them to exercise this bad judgment. A good criminal defense attorney can help lead them down a path of help prior to going to court, which can really help to mitigate what happens to them in court. In Los Angeles, this is Matt Mays for the Lawyers.com channel.